Pups save riders robot. Rider is switching on his new robot, Robodog, for the first time. Okay, Robodog, sit, says Rider. That's such a cool robot, says Kai. Thanks, I've just finished him, says Rider. Let's try digging. Rider presses a button and a Robodog tunnels underground at top speed. Rider peers down the hall. Where did it go? he says. Zuma is asleep in his pup house when Robodog pops up right underneath him. Whoa! Where did you come from? says Zuma. Ryder races around the corner. Sorry, Zuma, he says. I see you've met Robodog. Let's try flying instead. Robodog paws turn into rockets and he floats up into the air. Wow! Everyone says. It should be able to run really fast too, says the rider. No robot can outrun me, says Marshall. Let's race! Chase gets the pups into position, then uses his megaphone to shout. Go! Marshall and Robodog start to race, but just as Marshall takes the lead, he trips and rolls into a log. I'm stuck! shouts Marshall. Hold on! says Ryder, pressing the robot's turbo power button. Robodog goes even faster, pushing Marshall out of the log with a pop and zooming ahead. Marshall tries to keep up but stumbles into Ryder, who sits on Robodog. Oh no, the antenna is broken, says Marshall. Robodog jumps up, twitching and buzzing. Ryder tries to stop it, but the robot digs a tunnel and disappears. Suddenly, Robodog appears on Main Street. It flies straight into Mr. Porter's fruit stall and then he knocks Mayor Goodway on her feet. Mayor Goodway calls Ryder. Ryder, help! Someone's pet is on the loose. That's my robot, says Ryder. It's out of control, but we'll take care of it. Paw Patrol to the lockout, says Ryder. The pups line up in the tower, ready for action. We have to stop Robodog before it causes any more problems, says Ryder. If we can turn it off, I can try and fix it. Sky, with your zoom goggles, you should be able to spot it. And Rocky, I need you to help us build something so we can catch it. Let's take to the sky, says Sky. Green means go, barks Rocky. The rest of you, please tidy up the mess Robodo has made, says Ryder. Let's roll! Sky is in her helicopter looking for Robodo. He's heading towards the water tower, says Sky. Robodo crashes into the water tower and out of the other side. Then it flies straight to the pet shop. Katie and Kelly jump out of the way and into the bath. Guess he didn't want to use the doggy door, says Katie. Rubble and Zuma are on Main Street tidying up. Here's the last of the watermelons, Mr. Porter, says Rubble. Thanks for helping, pups, says Mr. Porter. I think we got all of it. But suddenly, Robodog appears and knocks them all over again. Robo sights. Sky holds Ryder on her helmet mic. Ryder, your robot is heading straight for me. Can we get him to fly towards Rocky's truck? Ryder says. I'll do my best, says Sky. 
looping away from the runaway robot. Meanwhile, Rocky has made something to catch Robodog, a magnet launcher. Almost ready, says Rocky. Sky draws Robodog closer to Rocky and Ryder. Rocky launches the magnet and it flies high into the air, then sticks to Robodog's metal body. Perfect shot, Rocky, says Ryder. You're on, Sky. Sky lowers the helicopter's hook and catches the magnet. Robodog is coming home, she barks. Sky lowers Robodog and onto Mr. Porter's patio. It tries to run around, but Ryder turns it off. I guess it's back to the drawing board, says Ryder. Sadly. Hold on, Ryder, says Rocky. I've got an old antenna you can use. Ryder changes the antenna and switches on Robodog. The robot is back to normal. Thanks Rocky and thanks to all of you pups too, says Ryder. I couldn't have fixed it without you. Well, if you're even in trouble, Ryder, says Rocky. Just yelp for help, all the pups bark. What a bunch of good pups, says Ryder, smiling. The end. <laughs>